look at that. That is really cool. All right, what you got in there? You see something? I saw this sparkle. Look at this piece. Wow. That's Greetings got Crawdad and Rusty, and we're checking out a whole new spot this morning. We've got Ruth and Ruby. Ruby. Hey, Ruby. Uh, she's intent on the hunt. This is another spot that sighted to have zeolites, so we're gonna look for some kinds of zeolites. Ruth's already found a couple here. What she got there? Yeah. Translucent. Some side of ty type of zeolites. Little tiny, tiny guys. <laughs> Little tiny ones are cool. They're gonna fill jars because I want to fill jars. Now, zeolites, as I understand it, we're going to start walking here. Zeolites are a little hard to distinguish between the various types. It's a pretty broad group. Hey, Russ, you ready to find some zeolites? Yeah, he's ready. Rusty's already right at it. All right, Russ, find me some crystals. Let me see. Did you find something? Hey, he's working. Oh, there's one. Got one there. It's a little one. Come on, keep going. What's in there? Yeah. Way to go. Minor. Nope, another little. Oh, that's a really tiny one. What's this one here? Oh, look. A little crisp crystal. What's this one? Oh, it's dirty because it was underground, but that's definitely a zeolite right there, Russ. Are you done? You lost attention? Okay. Fine. And we're off. So here's an example of a piece of basalt with some small gas bubbles that are uh, filled with zeolites. It's very small but really neat. It makes it look polka dotted. Look at all these little guys here. Look at all the little, the little gas bubbles filled with zeolite. Well, here's the one that's kind of cool. A little bit bigger. Got a nice gap in there. Oh, look at this. There we go. There's more crystals on Matrix. That's a nice little tiny specimen. I can see that going into my my rock shop, my free to everybody rock shop. Oh wow. That's interesting. It's chock full. You can see where it eroded off and left the shape of the bubble. Oh look at that. That is a dime in Oregon, and it's how I support my hobby, so I don't mind that. We'll put that down there, pick it up on our way. Hmm. I am recording nothing. I'll be back when there's something. Look at all that life. I do have a philosophy of life. People seem to think that if you give it an opportunity, life will find a way. I think just the opposite. If you give it an opportunity, death will find a way. Death is the norm. Life is the exception. So life being the exception is also then the greatest of privileges. What is that? Ah, oh, nice little crystal. Ooh. All right, now that might be worth a cut on the saw because that is a really pretty piece but um, I'm gonna leave it here because I'm sure somebody else would love to find that well, look at that that makes a nice little thumbnail specimen there's a couple there where the the shape of the original bubble is still visible that's a keeper a couple of hawks are really upset because buzzards are flying up over their nests probably they make a squawking noise when they're upset, don't they, Russ? Well, we didn't find anything more that way of any kind of size, so we decided to walk back this way, back to where the, the girls are, and work our way to the end of this cliff that direction, see what we can find. Um, going that way, I picked up two dimes, and it looks like there's another one right in front of us, Russ. Let's go check out this area, because there's a dime. <laughs> Coors Dime. Wow. Uh, thank you, Coors. 
Thank you, cores and piggy people. I'm sorry, I don't mean to be judgmental. I just don't think it's... Anyway, never mind. I'm not preaching. It's really cool. Look at that. It's ready. It's ready for a display. <laughs> huh? Okay. <laughs> Life simple pleasures, right, Russ? Okay, let's go on around. Go on around this little cedar tree. Come on, bud. Up above there, you can see there's some white. There's a little more over over there so that's a spot to check and there's some above here so here's a spot to check right Russ ah look there's some zeolite little tiny stuff ah that one's a little bigger more zeolite All right now we know how to find them huh Russ a little tiny pocket that's kind of cool So we got this whole hill to check. See what I can find? I'll show you my handful when I'm done. Because I'm hoping for a handful. Well, how's that for a handful? And that was just right over there. Now we come over here. And you can see even more. There's some in there. Some there. There's down in here. Some of these. Let's show you this one right here. Are actually the shapes of the bubbles there we go so that's the shape of the the bubbles so the z-light form here's another one that came right out of the bubble just like that that is not a zeolite even though i'm right here on the same hill that is a quartz crystal point because you can see the very clear um, window into that one you can see right through it so that would tell me that some of these formations are actually quartz. I'm going to put that one in my pocket, and we're going to look a little closer here. Rusty's got himself a hole going right down here. I doubt you'll be able to see in there. But those are little tiny fibers. Now that one is a fairly new break, and that one's a little older because it's filled with dirt. But both have little tiny fibers in there zeolite fibers inside the little bubble nodules all right Russ and I came up here Russ digging holes so I have footprints so we can see what was up here and yeah you can see this is where the zeolites down below are coming from and slowly the basalt is decomposing and you're left with just these little Nodules of zeolite, like that. That's pretty neat. It's not coming out, but it's very neat. I don't know how much I want to dig at this wall anyway, since it's pretty stable here. And they probably want to leave it that way. All right. Zeolite heaven. We're sliding while well, I was sliding. And we went past a couple things in this bush. First, this little nodule, which is a bubble, but then I saw this sparkle. Look at this piece. Wow. That's about the sparkliest zeolite I found so far today. Very nice. Beautiful. Wow, oh, here's a big one. There's a nice big nodule. Nice. It's my word. Nice. Come on, Russ. I'm almost ready. He wants to go see Ruby. They've been apart for a long time seeing each other. Wait, more nodules. Hmm. Nice. See, I told you it's my word. Oh, this is a spot to find the nodules. Look at these little guys. All these big nodules are and Rusty's doing some mining. Whoa, thanks bud. 
Okay, he's filling my my ba <laughs> bag with dirt and me. All right, what you got in there? You see something? Let me look down your tailings here. Keep going, bud, because I see some. There's a nodule. Aha, another little nodule. Aha. All right, let's see what else you found in there. Did you find anything else besides dirt? Let's work our way through here. Ah, there's one. Oh, look at these little tiny ones you got, Russ. Those are so cute. Okay, hey, 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 that's my shoe down there. Enough digging. Oh, look at the sparkly one. Look at the sparkly one. I'm pretty sure all of these are sparkly on the inside. But this is fun digging, huh, Russ? It is. Okay, that's enough. Russ, I think we have enough. Oh, got one more that you found. Good job, bud. Wow, you are a digging maniac. 